Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I have totally, totally missed you guys. I hope you guys have had a wonderful and blessed and family filled Thanksgiving. Oh my God, y'all. I miss y'all. It's been a while since I've been on here. I think two weeks since I've been on here. My dad was sick and trying to help my mom take care of my dad. And I miss you guys. Man, I've been longing for another YouTube video to to record and to put up and oh my god, I missed you guys. I can't I couldn't get rid of company enough. Oh my god, cuz it would have been too noisy. But I'm here. I'm back. I love y'all. And let's get into this video. I'm going to show you everything that I got for Black Friday and um yeah, I'm just going to get into this and show you everything. I'm gonna first start with uh um, I guess Walmart, since that is the largest that I have, is Walmart. So, the first thing I got, let's see. First thing I got, I went to the Black Friday sale, and I was able to find these. I had to go to three different Walmarts to find these, Roku SEs. They were $20. I wanted the ones that were, um, I forgot what it was called. And I wish I had my Black Friday sale paper here to tell you guys. But it's the bigger Roku where it has the remote and you can actually put the earbuds in your ear and listen to the TV through the remote. And you don't have to disturb anybody if you want to listen to put Pandora on and listen to the music through it or whatever. You could just fine. But these, um, I got these for my kid's bedroom because um, my kids don't really watch TV like that. So, and we got cable boxes in that room. So, to kind of, um, cut this TV off. I'm sorry. So, to kind of, you know, minimize the fact that they watch TV, that they don't, that they don't watch a lot of TV, we can send those boxes back to the cable company, save on money, and put these in there. And, you know, as long as we got internet and cable services, this works just fine. And we, they can get every channel they want. And then it was so great about it. They don't have to actually watch, wait until something comes on, on cable to watch it. They can just go to that station, pull it up, and the movie is right there or the TV show is right there. They don't have to wait until the actual scheduling for the actual TV. So I think these are a lot better. I, we already have two, one in the living room and one in um, our bedroom. Uh, but that's about it. So sorry about that, but yeah. I just think these are better than um, the actual cable boxes because uh, they don't have DVRs in their room. They just, we only have DVRs in the master bedroom and the living room. So if they get these, they can watch whatever they want to watch whenever they want to watch it. They've had them before, but um, at my mom's house, she needed uh, something to, because she has so many, she has six bedrooms. So just to when company comes so they can have some kind of cable or some kind of tv to watch um they left theirs at my mom's house for her to have and i told them i would buy them some more so that's their good old christmas gifts then next at walmart i purchased this um it was 19 is it 1997 or something like that? They had a whole list of them. So I got the Magic Bullet. I don't have it before. I didn't have it. I don't have it before. Listen to me. I did not have this before. So this is my first time ever getting one of these. And my daughter, she's on a health kick. You know, she doesn't eat pork or beef. But her mama does. I ain't skipping out on the pork or beef. But okay. I just won't eat as much. How about that? So, um, this here is, I thought this would be great for her to have, um, you know, to make smoothies and stuff like that because she's my health nut. She's my, um, health guru. That's what I call them. She works out 24-7. She eats veggies and fruits and lets me, she may just eat, she only eats chicken or turkey and fish but she doesn't eat uh beef or pork or lamb or goat or yeah we in the country we country folks we don't eat goat she doesn't eat goat i eat <laughs> you put some bam bam in front of me i'm gonna eat her too now but i thought this would be good for her you know and for me as well because i could stand to 
lose a lot of pounds. Um, I am on the obese side, so uh, I thought this would be good for us to have in the house and just make smoothies and, you know, skip meals and use this and supplement, you know, substitute the meals for this, whatever we, you know, make it here. So I thought we could use that and that would be great, especially for my husband. He doesn't, you know, that's the only way I can get him to get in his, um, most of his veggies because he will not eat them at the dinner table. He's worse than the kid. Now, also for my kids, I thought this box, this small box is a little heavy, but also for my kids, I thought this would be great and, um, they could use this, take it with them. When, they, when uh, my son goes off to college, uh, he can take it with him if he wants to. I don't care. But I just thought it would be um, helpful to get their TVs off of the dressers or whatever, or the TV stands, and they can use it to store or decorate or whatever. You know, he's a boy. You know, not all boys are real not tidy. So, I got this. This was $27 on Black Friday. And believe it or not, my husband went into Walmart by himself and picked these up himself. He felt like they needed these. And he grabbed two of these. One for my son's room and one for my daughter's room. She's already in college, but she um, goes to community college. And this right here, I think, with her room, because she does, she's starting to get into um, YouTube videos, and she does lashes. So, I thought this would be good. It's made by OWN, and it's for, a, oh, straighten up camera, 47 to 70 inch full motion wall mount, TV mount for... Full motion TV wall mount for the TVs and it gives them space and if they want to sit around in their room and turn to an angle like my daughter's desk is um, along the same wall as the TV so she can turn the TV and look at a uh, TV while she's sitting at her desk or whatever in her room so uh, I thought this was pretty great he, he wanted it for his baby so I said okay whatever whatever Next, this box is already open, y'all. I needed this after Thanksgiving. Um, oh, straighten up screen. There we go. So I needed this after Thanksgiving, after I cooked and company left. And I thought I had Tupperware to put my food in and did not have any. So I purchased, went to... Black Friday. This is the reason why I was going to Black Friday was this only for six eighty eight. I bought this one, which as you see has been open, so we used the larger containers out of it. And then I purchased this one for six eighty eight. So all I said was I needed something to put my food in. Did not have. A lot. They were six eighty eight. One is fifty piece set, and one is thirty eight piece set. The blue blue tops was thirty eight piece sets, and the plastic ones like these were the see through. The blue set is not see through. The thirty eight piece set is not see through. But these are, which I thought was fine, are fifty piece sets. So they both were six dollars and eighty eight cents, and I thought that was pretty good. So uh, I needed some more. So it was like either they had underneath my sink, either they had lids or it was just the lids and no bottoms or no, or it was bottoms with no lids. So I was like, where are, instead of trying to put pieces together, cause I was too tired from all that cooking and cleaning and everything and entertaining. I just went ahead and actually just went to Walmart and bought some new ones. That's, I mean. I know it's lazy, y'all, but I had to do it. And Black for Black Friday started right on time. I went about eight, even though you couldn't get anything until six p.m. By the time I got there at eight, I was able to get whatever I wanted to get, except for the sheets for twenty-four dollars. 
they didn't have any in my king size. They had them in the queen, which I should have got them for my son. I wasn't thinking. Oh, but anyway. Um, oh. Well, uh, I'll tell you guys. I, if you know, I bought the stainless steel trash can. It's so big, I can't pick it up anyway. Um, the It was $25, the stainless steel trash can for Black Friday. And I purchased that. Was not expecting to purchase it. They had four left, and I bought one of them. And I'm kind of glad I did. I needed a new trash can. My trash can was kind of, um, I've been having it for years, and I believe it's plastic, and it's the rubber made, and I bleach it down, you know, every so often, and get all the food crud, because every time people throw trash in there, they drip food outside of the trash. So I bleach it down and put it back in the kitchen and keep using it. So, yeah, I got that. And then let's go to Dollar Tree. All right. So, next from Dollar Tree, I bought these garlands. They're 15 foot garlands. Yeah, they of course they're dollars. Everything's a dollar at Dollar Tree. So, I bought these to use for my patio outside to decorate my patio. And then, so I bought two of those. Um, it's no guarantee that this is what's going to work. Don't know. We'll try, but don't know. Um, I bought two of these red bells from Dollar Tree. Two of them. Yeah. Sorry, that noise is my neighbors upstairs. Um, then I bought, uh, oh, I'm trying to get it out, people. Hold on. I should have took this stuff out the sack before I got started. You think? I bought four bunches of red poinsettias and they got the, I don't left them in the sack too long. They kind of wrinkled up, but that's okay. They're going outside on the decor outside, but they have the little, you know, glitter around them, gold glitter around them. And I bought four bunches, and I like them. thought they were pretty cute. So, yeah, my um outside is going to be red. But next year, my inside will be teal and red and gold. And maybe a hint of silver. And a little white. Too many colors, but okay. We'll make it work. And then... I bought three of these ribbons. These Not ribbons, I'm sorry. Bows. Glitter bows from the Dollar Tree. And I thought they were really cute to go on the garland. Make them um, work for the garland. I thought they were really cute. And right along with the um, red bells. So that I will be decorating today. Maybe. <laughs> Depending on how I feel. Um, do I have anything else? Um, didn't mean to make that fall over. Mm. So yeah, that's it for... Dollar Tree. Let's go to Michael's. Well, I needed a new planner, of course, because the year is ending. So I bought this planner. It was originally $24 with 40% off. I had a 40% 40, 40 off coupon. The lines were so long, I missed the 25% off of the total purchase. Was it total purchase or every item purchase? If, whatever the door buster for Michaels I that 25% off I missed that so I ended up catching the 40% off of the one item so this is my one trying to this is my one item I got for 40% off so I paid $16 for this 2019 planner and it says the steadfast Love of the Lord never ceases. Lamentations 3 and 22. Um, I don't know about you, but for me, I always need some kind of scripture in my life. I need to always keep 
the Lord in my life. I, I, woo, hallelujah. I need them. I don't know about y'all, but I need them. So, just wanted y'all to know, you know, um, they only had two of these particular ones left, um, that had this scripture on it. Uh, but they had several of them. They even had the bigger ones. I don't really need the bigger ones. They're like, tab like real notebook tablets i don't need the bigger ones because this goes in my bag sometimes or i don't, I don't want to have to carry too much so i need this to fit i need this to be big enough for me to have room to write as well as to fit in my purse that i got for my anniversary but that's about it you know i thought i, I liked it because it had scriptures on at the beginning of every month, you know, it has something, uh, can you see it? Um, well, it says, uh, beauty is God's handwriting. So, it has something inspiring on the beginning of each month, you know, and I thought that was, you know, his love's, his love gives life. So, I thought this is what I, I need every time I open it up, I can see that, and, just be inspired, you know. Because sometimes we lose faith and we lose sight of what we should be um, trying to accomplish. And a lot of times we don't end up um, doing what we should be doing. We we steer away and lose focus. And I've done it several times. I'm, I'm battling now. And I know I need them in my life. And I'm trying to keep moving forward. But um, I'm trying, you know. It, it's hard, you know, with everything that goes on in life, your family, you know, sickness, death, or whatever else. Um, you just have to, you know, and that's not just my, my blood family. That's just like my work family, my my um, my clients, anything, you know, those that is my family as well. So, um, sometimes you just got to have that little encouragement. Sometimes... You can't expect others to encourage you. You have to encourage yourself. So for me, I needed that because I have to be able to encourage myself because nobody is expected to encourage you but you. It's called self-esteem. And it's, Cat Williams said it best. It's self-made esteem. You know, you get it from yourself. So pushing forward. Um, I bought these beautiful, I should have took it out the, but this beautiful teal ribbon. And I'm thinking about putting it on my tree. I think I'm going to do a video of what my tree looks like now. And then do another video of what I did with my tree with this. But I love this so much. And it was $15 with... 70% off, so I paid five dollars for it. Paid five dollars and maybe some change for it. Um, at Michael's, and they had a 50% off of most Christmas because some things that I picked up were not 50% off, they were 25% off, and I put those 25% off right back and kept on with my 50% off as well as the 70% off. Some things were 70% off. Um, I was going to purchase another garland and I thought about it. If I get it at Michael's, I want that garland to stay in the house and I have enough garland in my house right now. So I was looking to decorate the outside with the garland that I bought from the Dollar Tree because if it gets torn up, messed up or whatever, because I live in an apartment. So if somebody tried to snatch it by, it was just a dollar. I won't feel too hurt or bad. So then the next purchase I got from, um, uh, Michaels was this six piece Ashland Christmas decorative chargers. I thought that was such a pretty, pretty, pretty color. I don't know about you guys, but I thought that was really pretty. That color. And I had actually picked up some pretty gold ones. They were gorgeous, y'all. They were really gorgeous. But I did not get those because I wanted to get something to decorate my table with right now. It kind of matches my couch. You can see. But I love these. They are so pretty to me. And they could be used all year long. They don't have to be just for Christmas. Um, 
I don't have many chargers, but I would love to... I'm actually trying to start building up my charger collection. I see a lot of guys on here on YouTube with a massive charger um, collection. And they can switch out their tables to be whatever. Well, you guys, I'm just getting started. And I want that as well. But I have chargers for when I do events. And I don't bother those chargers. I leave those chargers by themselves because after so long, chargers become, they get old and they will break. And I don't want to mess them up because if I lose a complete set, then or mess up one or two and I need one or two and I can't find them, I want them to stay together and stay good. So I, I leave those chargers in my storage so that um, when it's time for me to do um, a wedding event or birthday event or whatever else, I'll have those things. But this right here, I, I need to build up my charger collection for home. And I love these. These are so pretty. I love the color. They're so pretty. They're not like a gold color. They're like a... Uh, champagne. Champagne color. I don't know if it says the color on here. No, it's a champagne color, but it's it's beautiful. I love it. Um, that looks like that's it for Michael. So, now let's get to TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx. I... This this haul is for my daughter. I had this in mind for my daughter. Um, I bought her a, little, a lot of things that looks like her. You know, I told y'all she's a fitness person. You know, she's a I call her a a health guru. She loves anything healthy. So I knowing her, I bought her these Pumas. I saw these; they were thirty nine ninety nine. And I got her, when I saw these, I thought about her because she runs a lot. And she's um, she's a gymnast. She runs. She tumbles. She flips. She's a cheerleader. Um, she plays soccer. So, it's very easy for her to go through shoes. And I purchased these shoes for her. And they were just something. They're soft. They're really soft. I was like, oh my, when I picked them up, I was like, oh my God. They didn't have a pair in my size, but if they did, I would have got them. But I bought them in her size. These are seven and a half. And it's soft foam, comfort insert. But for this price, and it comes with the little sample of the foam here. Oh gosh, it's like memory foam. But anyway, it's, I love these shoes. I thought they would be cute for her to work out in or whatever else. Now, on the flip side of the health part of my daughter, she's also a beauty person. She loves makeup. She loves, um, you know, she loves hair, bundles, whatever. She will wear it. She loves, she does wigs. She'll make her own wig if she has to. Um, but again... She loves beauty. So I bought her this here from TJ Maxx. It's the Anastasia Beverly Hills sub Subculture. And it was $24.99. And it's eyeshadow. And I remember when Jackie Ina did it. She had showed it to me when Jackie Ina did it. But y'all know I don't go to Sephora or uh, Ulta. I'll wait till they get to TJ Maxx. These are really some beautiful colors. Oh my God. Beautiful colors. I mean, I'm going to hope I'm not blinding y'all with that. But I thought these were some beautiful colors. This adorn. Oh my God. That right there. That is so pretty to me. Oh, that is so pretty to me. Oh, and electric is gorgeous to me. Y'all, I like the bling stuff. It has like a greenish um, teal with a hint of bronze color to it. It's really pretty. It's really pretty. Oh, try not to mess it up. Because this is her Christmas gift. And by the way, she was there to pick it out, but she's just going to get it for Christmas still. 
I don't give them surprises. I let them find their own gifts. And then we just put it back under the tree when it's time for you to open it up on Christmas Day. And another palette that I picked up for her is the Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons. The packaging is so pretty. It is so pretty. Oh, this, these colors are really cute. I, I looked at them before, but now that I'm looking at them again in a different lighting. It's really pretty. Yeah, those are gorgeous colors. Really, really pretty colors. Really pretty colors. I like this dark chocolate right here. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. Yeah, and this one was... There's no price. Oh, am I holding it upside down? No. $29.99. It's $29.99. I'm trying to get it to show the price, but better look next time, huh? So, 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 so. The next palette that I purchased for Sister Girl. Oh my God, I can't even get this one over. Anyway, it's the Kat Von D Shade Light. It's a shade, shade plus light glimmer. That's the packaging. It's so pretty. And this one was $27.99. Uh, come on. Okay, it's not working for me today. But $27.99 is the price of this packet. Pack, packet. Palette. And... Let me see. Oh, it's really pretty. I didn't know. This was one I did not open up. I like how the details on the package is. It is so pretty. And it tells you the colors on the back. You know, for how the palette is laid out. Oh, okay. It's laid out exactly the same. I don't know if you can see it. Well, you'll be seeing all my background, but... um. Yeah, those are the colors. Those are really pretty. Those are really pretty. And she loves Kat Von D. And she has the Saints and Sinners palette. And that is like her best friend. The Saints and Sinners palette. And it's it's really some pretty colors in there as well. But um I can't get this back in. But anyway, um yeah, and I have to do another haul for my son because his stuff is being ordered so his stuff hasn't come in the mail yet and um he didn't ask for much um the only thing he asked for was a playstation car and he has his own youtube channel as well um and he does you know games he's a he's a gamer my baby is a gamer oh wait no i got more i got two more things um this Kat Von D Studded Kiss Lipstick. This is the box that it comes in. And the price was uh, $6.99. And this color is Solo. Oh. This is really pretty. This is a really pretty color. Oh, that's really pretty. It's a beautiful orange. Like a burnt orange or something like that. It's really pretty. I like that. Yeah. But I like the little studded case the lipstick comes in. That is cute. It's really cute. Forgot about these. And then... This one, this this color is another package. This color is Coven. Oh, I didn't realize the colors was on the top. Oh, yeah. And then this one is Coven. Oh, come on, come on. Anyway, looks like this is a lilac color. Yeah, 
I don't know if you can see that color. But again, the package is very pretty and detailed. Oh. Yeah. That is a really pretty color. I can see her doing this. I really can. I can't wait to what she looks like when she does this color. This is really pretty. Oh, this is pretty. I wish I had another one like this. I picked them up, y'all. They were six ninety nine. I didn't care what color they were. I picked them up because I know my child. So I think that concludes this haul, my Black Friday haul. And I did okay. I. Didn't I want, oh, oh yeah, I, I, well, my husband threw away the box, but I would at least put the box in the film, but I did buy the uh, $49 um, vacuum that was at Walmart for Black Friday. I can't remember the name. I think it's Bissell or Eureka. I think it's Eureka. Whatever. It's the $49 one. Okay, that's the one I purchased. And because my vacuum cleaner was, oh, child. I think I had that vacuum for 10 years. And when I vacuumed, the handle would fall apart. So I needed a new vacuum. I wouldn't dare do a clean with me with that vacuum on YouTube for you guys to talk about me. I was not about to do it, okay? Y'all are not gonna y'all are not gonna talk about me. That that just ain't gonna happen. I'm not gonna let y'all talk about me like that. But anyway, um, this concludes my haul, and I thank you guys for watching me, and I will be doing another video of my Christmas decor, and I told you guys I'm going to do a Christmas decor with my tree, with how it looks now, and then versus, I put the ribbon I just purchased from Michael's, see how that looks, with it, and... That's about it. That's about it. Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed yourself just like I have enjoyed myself. I missed you guys. I really, really missed you guys. And I'm glad that I came back to see you guys. I do. I do. I do. I'm glad I'm back. But um, I hope you guys have had a blessed and wonderful Thanksgiving. I hope you guys be safe in these streets while Christmas shopping. You know, a lot happens during Christmas time. And just if you have any issues with anybody, just go to them and tell them I love you. I love you. I love you. Just go to them and tell them that so that you can be peaceful. Not them, but you. You don't have to have that conscious over your head. So... Go and love your family members or friends or enemies, frenemies, whatever you want to call them. Go and love them no matter what. You know, it's too much. Life is too short. So enjoy the life to the fullest. Don't take life for granted. Don't take people for granted. Um, you know, if you know that they are liars, then at least you know they're going to lie to you. They're going to be themselves and keep lying. Okay, you just can't. You just got to know you can't remember who they are. You know you got to remember that they don't. That they gonna lie. They gonna be them. They just gonna lie. You don't know the truth about them, but they gonna lie. So accept the fact that they lie and keep going. You know they gonna be themselves. If you got somebody who's just angry, at least you know they gonna always be angry. That's their mood. Call them and tell them you love them anyway with their angry selves. I was once an angry person, so. You have to go out and love people for who they are. Don't mistreat anybody. Don't use anybody. You know, you know what the people are, who they are, what they are, what they're going to be, who they're going to be. So just accept them no matter what. You know what I'm saying? Just you, you don't try to change them. Leave them who how they are. Eventually, life will change them. So just love everybody. Love, love, love everybody. Just like I love, love, love you guys. Mwah. I love all of you guys. And I thank you guys for watching my channel. 
I thank you guys for being so supportive. I thank you guys for coming back to see me, being patient with me with videos. I love, love, love every each and every one of you. And I thank you guys for tuning in. And hopefully uh, in the next few days, I'll come back with the video um, that I had. And oh, today is Saturday. What's today's date? The 21st? 22nd, 22nd, 21st, 22nd, whatever day. It's sat it's it's Saturday after the Saturday after Thanksgiving. Okay. After Black Friday. Got it. So uh I love you guys. I love you guys. I love you guys. Be supportive. Please like, comment, subscribe to my video, to my channels. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button so you can get notifications every time i upload a video that you guys would love to watch and please leave a comment about what videos you want me to watch you know whatever it, is, it may be just put put a comment down there hey girl you know put a country comment down there if you if you want to be country whatever i love everybody so just put you know send share this video Share with somebody that may be inspired by this video or whatever else. Y'all, my eyes are running. I, I'm kind of hot, and I put a ceiling fan on. It's not really cold here. It's cool here in Texas, but it get hot. Mm. But it's now 122. So by this time, it get hot, y'all. It get hot. And again, it's Texas. We get cold. We may have snow. We may get full, all four seasons in one day. So, I mean, I'm just saying, it's Texas. So, one day you can put, you got to put on sweats and boots, and the next day you can put on shorts and flip-flops. Just saying. But anyway, share this video, like, comment, subscribe, and I love you guys. 